Yeah, I think it's it's gone really good so far, getting really good work with Sean Ketting. Um, honestly, it's been my best camp so far um, of my three years. So, What do you think has made it your best camp so far? Anything specifically feel different this year? Um, no, really, I just, I just feel I'm really good. I'm hitting a really good ball. Um, yeah, I mean, I'm just hitting a good ball. That's what it is. Harrison, coming into, and I know you did a little bit last year, but especially now coming into camp, starting to get some national attention and All-American recognition. I mean, is that stuff you that's easy for you to block out or, or not pay attention to? How do you deal with it? Yeah, no, that's a good question. Um, I mean, I don't, I try not to really think about it. It's, it's nice to be recognized, obviously. But, you know, if I'm going to be recognized, I want to be an All-American, but I want to be an All-American for this team. I want to, you know, I want to be there for this team, the team, the team, the team. Um, and it's not just for me. I'm not doing it for me. I'm trying to help my team win on Saturdays. I and mean, that's really where my mind's at. And so, yeah, I do block it out. Um, but it's really just about putting points up there for my team. What is your standard for yourself? I mean, from the outside, people a lot of times only notice kickers if, if something goes wrong. When you've had such a good two years already, what's the standard and how do you kind of either maintain or go to another level? Yeah, um, you know, really just focusing on myself. Um, it's it's just next kick mentality. You know, it's not, yeah, if you miss a kick, you know, it's next kick. I don't remember the, the last kick. Um, so it's what, you're only as good as your next kick. So that's really where it's at. And that's, that's really where my mind is. And that's where, you know, that's what I'm focusing on next kick it doesn't matter what I did the last two years it does not matter to me I'm just as hungry as I was my freshman year um I want to make all the kicks this year you know 92 percent for me is unacceptable um I gotta be 100 percent this year and that's you know that's where it's at so Arson, you, uh, you were saying you were getting some reps with with John Kent and yeah. um how's how's that adjustment been for not just you but for him as well really good he's a fantastic older um he obviously he helped for Tucker McCann in 2019 so it's, it's really good to have another guy with experience. That's what really what it is. Um, no, but he's, he's fantastic back there. Jack and, Jack and Sean have both done a really good job. So. Is there anything you have to tell the whole, your holder? Like, is there anything you would uh, sort of catch him up with about the your last two years? Uh, no, I mean, when I, when I first got here, Sean was like, Grant wasn't here yet. So I was originally getting that spring work with Sean. So he kind of already knows I like my ball straight up and down. And, um, and I, I'm really simple with him. I, I mean, he, he does a fantastic job, and he already, you know, he's good. So, yeah. He's probably one of the more overlooked guys on this team, but now there's a chance he's your punter, your kickoff guy, and your holder. I mean, how many different things can, can Sean do? Uh, yeah, I mean, he pretty much does it all. I mean, uh, he does, does a really good job at it, so. What, what if he, like, has to throw out of a fake field goal or something? He good enough to do that? Uh, yeah, I mean, we, we sometimes just mess around and throw around, but it's not really intent. Sean has an arm. Jack was, I think Jack used to be a quarterback, but I mean, we, yeah, I mean, they both have arms. I mean, shoot, we all just mess around. Shoot, I don't have an arm, but um, <laughs> yeah, no, we, yeah, they have an arm, so.